Hey guys, it's Jim Halterman from TV Guide Magazine and TV Insider, and I'm here with Joshua Morrow, who plays Nick Newman on The Young and the Restless. Look, right now, all I can think about is finding our baby. Got anything yet? <sighs> yes. There she is. I have her location. Where is she? She's just over the hill and to the left, but Nick, according to this, I hope this is wrong because it says she's moving really fast. Josh, this has, been, this, this has been a rough week for Nick and Sharon and the family. How has it been for you to shoot these scenes? Because you, you've done some heavy emotional lifting throughout your run on the show. But I feel like whenever there's a kid involved, it gets just another level. How has it been for you to shoot these episodes? I find it easy to play because I love my children so much. I love my TV children so much. Yeah. Um, but, you know, it's hard. It's not a place that you uh, are comfortable being taken to. Um, I don't enjoy it at all um it's 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 fulfilling because you feel like you've you know you've done some some solid work but uh you know nobody ever wants to go down that path whether it's in real life obviously or pretend land yeah one, one thing i like about this show is that no matter where nick and sharon are in their relationship when their family needs help they come together um yeah. I think that, and that's something we've seen over the years do you think that's that's a good thing that we keep that going because they can have conflict, but then it kind of all goes away when something like this happens. I absolutely do. Um, you know, they, um, they're obviously each other's first love, but they, they have a bond that is uh, pretty unmatched. Um, they grew up as children essentially, and uh, have been through more than any couple should have to. Um, and then obviously, no matter where each other is in their uh, romantic lives with other people, um, when things get serious, they tend to, you know, kind of rally around each other and, and do what they can for the family. Yeah, it's it's such a great soapy twist that Adam is the one who can actually save Faith. Um, I love that that reveal comes out in today's episode. Yeah, it's uh, it, it, it is really awesome that they're doing that because obviously of all of the issues that everybody has with Adam uh, it's a it's a really great opportunity to tell some 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 story that you know is tough I mean it's hard to accept him um, most of the time and then when he does something heroic which he tends to do you know it, it's hard not to you know kind of under you know kind of bring him in and 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 be very appreciative especially when it involves children so uh, it's a great story, involves everybody, and uh, I think everybody does a really good job with it. Do you think with what Adam hopefully will be able to do to help Faith that it could mend some fences, or do you think it's actually better that, you know, people still kind of like to butt heads with him? You know, obviously, if, I just matter who it is, if somebody saves your child's life, there is a certain amount of, uh, oh, man, gratefulness that has to to come out and uh nick is uh you know it, it's it's very tough for him it's a tough pill to swallow uh having to uh a be around him but also b act uh cordial to him so um you know we'll see uh you know it, nick nick is uh nick is obviously the nicest guy in town always it seems like but <laughs> he's he he really holds grudges so uh we'll see if adam can kind of break through that at some point Okay. And just to tease what's coming next, how easy or difficult will it be for Nick to find Adam and get him to come back since Adam's kind of a wanted man at the moment? Well, it's going to be very difficult. Um, a, he's got to find him and B, certainly the more uh, delicate part of the equation will be convincing him that he needs to do something that isn't about himself. Um, you know, uh, Adam has shown in the past to be willing to do something like that, but not because Nick has requested it of him. So that's going to be a very interesting uh, negotiation between these two characters who really don't like each other. You guys, The Young and the Restless airs every day on CBS. Joshua Mara, thank you so much for your time. Appreciate it. Anytime, thank you very much.